Uh, street lights and repairs. Now we're on to the one that Fred had mentioned that he had uh, we he had provided some numbers uh, in regards to emergency management. No, that's, nope, emergency no. management was a thousand dollars. You voted on street that one, lighting. which was here. Okay. So we had uh, we had asked back about some of the street lighting and some of the um, uh, traffic signals. Um, right. The um, Fire department came back with a, a budget of re, uh, replacing the three existing. We, we have one done. We did the center of town, Hampton, with the mm -hmm. new uh, photo sensor. Right. Uh, they came back with the other three lights at $18,510 per, installation, per installation, which is $55,530 for the total. I wouldn't suggest putting $55,000 there one year. No. My suggestion is that you do one this coming year and then perhaps two the following year. I, I think that's a, a good idea. And also we have a price to to change the remaining light. Uh, there are two types of bulbs in a, in a traffic signal. There right. are, are LED lights and there are incandescent lights. Right. About a third of the ones that are there are the LEDs and the rest of them are still incandescent. Yeah. The incandescent bulbs don't last as long, and the energy savings is about if if we changed all of them over, almost four to one would be about uh, forty four hundred dollars a year savings. So it would cost us about fifteen. Is it fifteen? Fourteen thousand seven hundred change with changing the pedestrian signal upgrades. Right, and the pedestrian signal upgrades right now, they don't meet the MUCTD, or, no. which is the... The Metco standard, no. It's, which is the standard for traffic signals. Correct. And, and, the, and the, so that would change those bulbs to do that. So um, I would suggest that we, we uh, increase traffic signal to 18... 18... 18, 5, 10... By eighteen five and four, fourteen and fourteen seven for the other, on top of what's already there. On yes, a additional, and that would give us, like I say, the, the fourteen seven that'll be paid that'll pay for itself in three years. Yeah, uh, and then those lights, uh, some of those those LEDs have been up there for ten years or better. So yeah. right. I make that motion that we increase by eighteen five ten and fourteen seven hundred is the correct. Yep. In the same That's motion. Correct. Yep. All right. I make so is that, that all motion. on the same on the street light repair line? Yes. Okay. So let me get those numbers in here real quick. Hold traffic on. traffic light repairs. Yes, traffic light, sorry, not street <laughs> yeah. light. So we're gonna add same thing. Fourteen thousand seven hundred? Correct. Yep. And, and eighteen what? Five ten. Five ten. Okay. Sorry. I just want to get that. That in there. will save us from digging those streets up and replacing those wire loops in them every few years. Which they have done. Every one of those is, is, as, and as they get older and the pavement gets worn, those tr those uh, trips in the ground have to get repaired right. two or three times a year at, at a cost of two to three thousand dollars each time they come in. Yeah. And it's 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 the one in the middle of the town, right? That has the the the, the yeah. canal. Yes. Yeah, yes. and that yes. is that if you, if you sit there, well. it works really well because yeah. if there's nobody in the turn lane, it doesn't go to the turn. Right. So it really does a much more efficient yeah. job. Absolutely. So, uh, what was the total of that? Twenty. Thirty. Thirty-two. Thirty-two. Hold on, I went to another screen. Thirty-seven thousand two hundred ten, and then we had two hundred twenty thousand zero one eight for the electric part of that so for that whole section for street lighting it would be two hundred and fifty seven thousand two hundred and twenty eight dollars i move that amount i'll second it all those in favor unanimous 